Last week, my scene drops for Brazzers. The next day I wake up, my phone is ringing off the hook. Emails, messages, direct messages. So what I realized was overnight, I again became a dollar sign. I forgot what that fucking was like. The torture of being a walking dollar sign. And what I mean by that is that trigger of my scene going up on Brazzers affected people in the industry who want their share of that money too. But what's funny is most of these people haven't spoken a word to me since I left. As a matter of fact, there were only two people in the business that congratulated me on my retirement. One was Christian Triple X and one was Lainey, my PR girl, two. So you can imagine how all of those other people who I'd been literally dead to for all this time are now just coming out of the fucking woodworks. Some of them, it's been pretty priceless. One of the messages I got, I was able to scroll back and see their last message from December of 2014, the day I retired and announced my retirement on my Facebook page. The message said, when you're broke and desperate, hit me up because I'll shoot you. Flash forward to 2018, this person texts, hey, what's your rate? I want to shoot you. I write back, why don't you scroll back and see your last text to me? If you can't see it, I'll cut and paste it. So I cut and pasted it. What does the person say? I was just kidding. I proceed to write back. So you know, the fact that you haven't engaged with me since the last time I made you money completely validates the extent of our relationship. Your money that you made off of me I hope you saved it because I'm not letting you make any more. Go fuck yourself. This has brought out that side of me that I kind of forgot about. That side of me that can be more than shrewd. That side of me that can be like, I heard a quote from LeBron today that said, People won't like me when my patients are tested. That's the quote from LeBron. People won't like me when my patients are tested. That's right. So these people are not testing my patience, but reminding me of a very dark time of dealing with a lot of bloodsuckers. This is the life I chose. Chose. Chose.